Hi there, in this video I'm here to show you how to send files or photos from your MacBook to your iPhone. The first thing that you want to do is to click on the Apple icon on your MacBook. Click on it and then you click on system settings. Then once you do that, it's going to show you all your settings. You want to focus on general. So you click on general over here and then you want to click on airdrop and handoff. And then once you do that, you want to go on the setting that says no one. And then you see contacts only or everyone. I'm going to pick contacts only because I'm going to be sending to a contact that's my phone. If you're sending to someone else that's not on your contacts, then you click on everyone. It's going to give you 10 minutes. Another way to access is to go to this icon over here in the corner. And then you want to click on airdrop. You can either turn it on and off and then you want to keep it on on contacts only. Then I'm going to come to my iPhone. I'm just going to click on settings on the iPhone. Once you click on settings, you want to click on general. Then once you click on general, you want to scroll down to where it says airdrop. You want to click on airdrop right there. And then you want to focus on the settings over here. So receiving is currently off and I'm going to put it on contacts only. If you want to send to someone else, you can do it for 10 minutes. So there's a photo on my desktop that I want to send. I'm just going to click on it just like that. And I'm going to go ahead and right click on it. And then the options that are going to come uh, to share I want to click on share right there and then once I do that then I'm going to select airdrop because there's many ways to send files on your MacBook but we're focusing on airdrop click on airdrop and then the contact that I'm trying to send which is my phone is right there you can send to many phones whilst you are waiting so I'm just gonna click on it it's gonna say waiting and then on the phone it's going to show you the option so you can either accept or decline I'm gonna go ahead and accept the photo and then I'm gonna go to my photo so that I see where my photo was sent there is the picture that I just sent so this is how you send files or photos from your MacBook to your iPhone